Hello everyone, how are you? I hope everybody is fine and welcome again in this new video which will be about what you see in front of you, this uh, rotor, it's a Huawei HJ8245H model and it's largely used in a lot of the countries all over the world and here in Morocco it's used by uh, um, at least uh, 1 million people of uh, internet users simply because the biggest uh, internet provider in Morocco is Maroc Telecom and it uses uh, this exact model for eight or nine years now so unfortunately I have this one and as I have promised in my last video that I will do a video about this one which will be about how to how to fix the issue of uh, uh, the supervisor login so as most of the users of this of this router know that the uh, supervisor password can't be uh, changed in the settings and we can't either change the account name or the username and here in Morocco the, this model uses the telecom uh, admin as the user as the username of the account and uh, admin telecom as a password uh, let me just show you for example if we do simple search here in the internet and yes let's uh, choose default password go to first result so here for example we have different username and passwords which we can find in this model in this model so uh, it depends on the provider and on the country so here in morocco we use the provider use uh, has programmed the router on this account username telecom admin and the, the, the default password admin telecom which either of them can't be uh, changed in the settings in fact as you all know users of this router uh, this router uh, we can get in uh, login the settings using two different accounts uh, we can login as a root let me show you i have an image of my own router here so we just tape uh, this address ip on the on our browser and we use root as a username and the password which is indicated on the bottom of your router and you are in uh, let's get in the router and so uh, 68.100.1 enter so let's get in as root and my password is this ah sorry you don't see it you don't need to see it so never and as you can see here we by default uh, we are uh, uh, we get in this page which allows us to change the password of this account root so we do we do root account it's not an issue we can change the password but the problem is with the supervisor account which uh, with which we can do some settings which we can't do with the root account mm, the supervisor account uh, it's not possible to change the password in the settings but we can change it using uh, uh advanced knowledge which is not uh, acquired uh, which is not uh, which most of the users uh, do not acquire so we simply need to change instead of changing the password we simply need to change the 
name the username the account username which either we can't change in the settings but we can change it in the configuration file using this free tool which we can download from the internet hxd editor it's a it's an editor of the binary files which we use which professionals use uh, when dealing with bios issues so let's go back to our router and so what we need in fact uh, we don't need to bother ourselves if you go to the internet you will find a solution on how to change the password but i don't advise you to do that instead of that you just need to you to change the user name so let's let's log in as supervisor and me i am no longer using the default uh, name i am using my name me the 77 era and let me show you the default password so that you can see that let's open this so we see that the uh, the default password is admin telecom it's an extra letter here. let's skip it so as you can see as you can see here i don't know if you can see that clearly so let's zoom on that again let's copy paste bingo we are in so and as you know in the supervisor for example we can open the lands by default it's only the first line which is opened so when you first get this router you won't have these ones open so you need to log in as a supervisor to do that you can't do that in the root uh, account and then we go to system tools and there we simply need to download the configuration file on which we can do the changes so me now i don't have the default configuration so if i downloaded this file it will have the name which you just have seen me log in with it so but we can use it as an example on how to do that so let's put here new folder uh, simply over week the, the brand of the of the rotor see we open so show in a folder and i i am using this as the name of the account we copy we go our folder which in which we have saved the configuration file let's refresh here we drag and drop the file here and with the control f we search for the supervisor username in your case if you're still using telecom admin you have to tape here telecom admin in my case which i ha already have changed the username and uh, i don't want in fact to restore the default because i will have to do a lot of settings again in my router so let's uh, do uh, with this this uh, same name here and let's hit enter and we are in so we have only one result even with the telecom admin the default you will get one result if we hit f3 we won't get any other result 
So and you go to the beginning just before M. So my my username here is middle seventy seven era. Just you click before the M here in this HX the editor, and you use your name. Let's for example use seeker with the capital K, and just delete era. So. Pay attention, don't delete the brackets. You need the brackets, otherwise you will get an error when trying to load this file on your router. So you save. When you save, you will get this file, which is in fact a backup with .bak, which means a backup, a backup of the original file. Which means that this file, now this one, which is highlighted is the file that has me the 77 era as a username this one has the uh, new name which is seeker with the capital r let's paste here sorry no i haven't i haven't copied that control z Select just this one and erase. So copy, paste here. So this is the new name. And as you can see here, we have the password here. And the password here, in fact, is on, uh, in fact, is a secure hash algorithm. So it's generated by a super, oh, secure hash algorithm. Uh, exactly 256 so we can change it but for most users you don't need to do that you don't need to change the password at all don't go uh, or you if you don't pay attention to what you're doing you may break the, the firmware the your uh, router so just change the name and keep the default password no one knows your name that's that's it so let's go back to our uh huawei uh, configuration tab let's browse our file here so we say this one is the new one this one is the one that we have downloaded so this one contains our new username open update okay so you wait until the uh, router restarts and to uh, make changes with restart yes and uh, once done you get in using your new name with the default password so this is the name let's copy it and let's wait for so and uh, you will need again to open the ports two three and four because they are by default uh, closed you can't use them you won't get any connection before uh, opening them in the uh, in the router in the configuration uh, of the router so let's wait until we get again the the load genes here so aquant said seeker with the capital k and uh, the default uh, sorry, admin telecom is the default. Oh, I already have it above. I was, I thought that it's the user account. So let's copy admin telecom paste. I am doing this copy paste because you can't see what is written here. That's why. So let's make things easy so now we are 
in as a seeker the name of our account let's go to LAN and let's open our ports okay that's it I hope it's clear and uh, now I have to as you already know my name I have to choose another name and save it I hope this video will be useful for those uh, needing uh, these changes and sorry for um, those who have asked me a lot about this sorry for being late in doing this video but i really uh, lack time of doing uh, youtube videos uh see you in the next video uh, which i don't know i don't have the subject in fact so the next one will be an interesting video it will be about a trick or something like that so i'm not uh, i'm not uh, going to record uh, videos which we can uh, find in the internet so until the next video, see you and bye-bye.